Florence School District 1 is pleased to announce the completed renovations to the former Burns property located on 1201 Ashby Road in Quinby. The newly named Alfred Rush Academy is very significant in the history of public education. Well, I'm sitting here reflecting on how 40 years ago or so, I studied South Carolina history and never once heard about Alfred Rush, our great-great-grandfather contributed so much to the history of South Carolina. He was a slave. They called him a manservant. Worked on the G plantation. G was a politician and a lawyer. I understand that Alfred Rush often accompanied him on business. And apparently he was well read and learned. Wrote very well, has a beautiful signature. And um, shortly after the war, the Civil War was over and slavery ended, and when blacks were given the right to vote, they voted. And Alfred Rush was elected a state representative for Darlington County, which at that time included Florence. Florence County had not yet been established. But when he went to the legislature, he, like the other members, African Americans, believed that education was the key for blacks to progress it was fundamental. And when they went to the legislature, one of the things that they accomplished, what I consider one of their most significant accomplishments, was the adoption of a new state constitution, which mandated free public education for the first time in South Carolina. And the interesting thing about that is that although it benefited slaves and former slaves, it also benefited every child in this state. The Constitution required that it be available for all children, regardless of race or gender. Gender is also key, because before then, women didn't, weren't educated. I didn't, it was a belief that they didn't need to be educated because they took care of the home, so there was no need for them to be educated. So that singular accomplishment, the mandate of free public education, basically transformed South Carolina from an illiterate state to a literate state and is largely part of the groundwork for the success, our future success. Alfred Rush was a public servant, the epitome of a public servant. The Alfred Rush Academy is growing young minds and instilling values and confidence with two separate age groups. The Academy provides an alternative to the traditional school settings for students in grades 7 through 12. You can tell by the excitement of our students today. Um, they're excited each day of coming here just because of the newness of it. Um, once you go around and see the, the facilities, is second to none um, here with the educational technology and the, and the, and the facilities that we've um, produced. The Nest is a nurturing environment for three and four year old Montessori students. The purpose of this program is to help young children uh, put them in a nurturing environment where they can develop their full potential and we're also trying to make sure that each child has a chance to develop fully into themselves. The school is now equipped with state-of-the-art technology, newly painted classrooms, new carpet and furniture. In Florence One, the transformation at Alfred Rush Academy embraces our motto, educate, prepare, and inspire.